If your phone is showing call voicemail instead of showing your voicemail visually, this video is going to go through and help you get this corrected quickly. That way you can have your voicemail all set up. So make sure you watch this video and do everything it says, and this should go through and resolve any issues you're having. Welcome everybody, I'm Kevin with HelpfulTutorials.net. I want to thank you for stopping by and checking out this video. I hope it really does help you out. If you're new here and you like iPhone tutorials, iPhone fixes, and app discovery, please do me a favor and subscribe. And with that said, let's go ahead and just jump right in this. So here we have the screen showing call voicemail and it's not showing the voicemail set up. So that means your visual voicemail is either not enabled or the phone is not seeing it. So what we want to do is go to your home screen and what we're going to do here is pull down from the top. One of the ways to go through and take care of this is by going through and putting it in airplane mode. Basically that resets your cellular connection. That may happen if it hasn't been that long. If it's been a long time, it probably won't help, but you could go ahead and tap the airplane turn it on, leave it on for about 20 seconds and then click it again and it'll turn off. Keep in mind when you do this, your phone will lose all connectivity of everything that's going on right now. So if you are currently watching something in the background or playing music, it's probably going to stop just for those moments. The next step is it could be an issue with your settings and you may just need to do a network reset. I've showed this in some other videos. How do you do it is you go ahead and choose settings and then you're going to go ahead and choose general. From here, we're going to scroll down to the bottom. We're going to choose reset. Now there are a few different options here. Reset network settings is most likely going to take care of it for you if it is an issue with the phone itself, but keep in mind this is going to reset other things. It'll reset the name of your phone, it'll reset all the Wi-Fi connections you've ever made on the phone, and could do some other things as well. You will not lose any of your pictures, videos, apps, anything like that. It's just settings that are set up with the network. So what you could do is go ahead and click on that and then it'll ask you for your passcode if you have one and it'll walk you through resetting that. Once it's reset, what you want to do, and it may restart, you want to go ahead and go back into your phone icon and see if you have visual voicemail. If it's not showing, you may want to close out of the app. To do that, just swipe up and to the right and you'll see all the apps open. Swipe the voicemail up. And then you can go ahead and tap outside of the other app if you have any other apps open and then simply go back into voicemail. If it's still showing the same thing, then most likely you need to go ahead and contact a carrier. So what they can do is either remove your visual voicemail and then re-add it and that'll take care of it. Or you can go through and delete your voicemail box and set it back up if you don't really have anything invested in it. So if you don't have any messages on there that you need or anything, they could always just do that. There's also ways to go through and text to go ahead and get the visual voicemail put on and taken off. I do know you can dial 611 from your phone. That's AT&T, Sprint, T-Mobile, or Verizon. And if you're in the U.S. and you'll be able to get to a associate, they'll be able to delete it for you. If you're looking for some tips and tricks to really help you out with your phone as well, I also have a great video on my website, helpfultutorials.net. Go ahead and check it out. I'll have the link in the description in the comments, and they'll go through and teach you a lot of cool tricks that not many people know about the iPhone. Thank you so much for the view.